Adventures in Game Changers. <laughs> Out of my way! I've got a cart to fill. Hey, you! Find charcoal and barbecue sauce. Yes, sir. Shopping done. <laughs> this is bad. Tobot W, frost capture. Here it comes. Do you know what's really not okay? Wrecking someone else's property and taking things you haven't paid for. What are you waiting for? Get in! Huh? Hope you don't mind my drop it in. Bring it on. Watch out! Try again! Look! There they are! Hey, Nathan! Can you lure them toward us? They won't come down! I'm over here, you Jurassic jerks! Son and kick! What is the Still on the ground, I see. <laughs> Why waste time on you? Are they ignoring us? It appears we've trained against flying bots for nothing. Hang on! The groceries! Seriously, is food all you think about? I have an idea! To the left, to the right, hover! Ah! Uh. <laughs> oh yeah, check it! Barbecue in our place tonight! Give that back, it's mine! Huh? Oh, it smells so good, I have to have some! Oh, doesn't it smell delicious? We'll eat all of this. Don't mind, do you? We'll take every box. No, 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 no! They're coming! Nice, Corey. Now, Tobot X. Ready? Power smash! Power smash! Sonic kick! Sonic kick! Yeah! <laughs> That's it! Uh, come on, Raptor Bots! Go take back what's wrongfully mine! Hold on! You need to cool down. How about a little frozen treat? Ice blast! Gotta go. Uh, this needs to be kept refrigerated. Can we eat this all the time? Oh, yeah! You had a long day, Corey. It was... Mm, tiring. Oh, I'm wiped. Can I skip homework and just sleep? Corey, no. Homework's important. Let's do it together, after dinner. Mm. Franklin and Limo can look after the Tobots. They deserve some care after doing such a fantastic job. Right. <laughs> Franklin, have you noticed anything a little odd about how Sora's been acting? Why? What do you mean? The old Sora was very arrogant, selfish, and unapproachable. Now it feels like she's pretending to be different. Now that's not fair, Limo. What about yourself? Have you forgotten? You once thought of destroying the city. <laughs> well, there's that. You know, people change as they grow older. Speaking of change, who likes oil? Well, you're overdue. Oh, no, 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 no! There's no need for that! We're in top shape! Sora changed the oil! What? Great stuff! Mm -mm -mm. Are you telling the truth? Why would I lie to you? Sora told us you were feeling pretty exhausted from chasing after Cory and Ryan, so she did you a favor. Oh, she's the best. Hmm. Was it a different oil than usual? She brought it? There is no need to doubt Sora. <laughs> First one's mine! Ta-da! I knew he'd do that. It's like he's inhaling it. Sometimes I wish we took gas like regular bots. <laughs> gas. Now, my dear underlings, in honor! Of my taking Acme's place, I hereby declare this an eat anything you want week. Mm. Any ideas for dinner later? <laughs> no! They're emptying my store! How dare you, thief! Frost Capture!
Now that the dinosaur robots seem to be focusing on supermarkets and restaurants, the city's residents are less inclined to dine out. But those who don't mind a little dinner... Mr. Dillick, what are you up to? You seem to be having too much fun. ...defense against these troublemakers. Officials and citizens are thanking the Tobots once again for... See that? Something rescue. weird's happening. You think? What's with the new food focus? Acne used to plan serious heists. Now all she seems to care about is food. It's suspicious. Mm. It's almost like there's someone else behind this. Or maybe she's trying to take all her food, so we'll all just leave for somewhere else. I think she wants the whole empty city to herself. Hmm. Or maybe she's building a new giant robot who has to eat a ton of food every day for fuel. So she's stockpiling all the food in advance so she can use the new robot against us. Possible. Hey, what do you think, Dylan? Hmm. Maybe she's just having a growth spurt and she needs to eat a lot. What? Uh, uh, just joking. I'm gonna go to Ryan and Corey's. You can come too if you want. <laughs> I can't take this much longer. Don't you think we're programmed for something more? Your favorite instance now, just what should I have for lunch to today? Instance, for some reason, I'm thinking like noodles. Mr. Dillick, I have a deal for you. Grand opening! Fresh and delicious huh? seafood! Hmm. If it were any more fresh, it would swim away. Oh, I want I that! I want that now! Wow, you're in great condition. Well, Miss Sora's engine oil is specially enhanced. Yeah, I'm all jumpy. It's like she gave us liquid vitamins. I feel brand new. Don't you think this might be a little large? Extra space is always better. You might make new robots. You never know, do you? What new robots? I don't plan to. Well, I'm sure you're worried about the kids. Me worry? Why would I? Their lives are so action-packed. I'm sure they're tired of it by now. They should take a break from the Tobots. <laughs> I'm sure they'd disagree with you if you asked. They like excitement. And just think how much they're learning about responsibility and the importance of helping others. Don't get me wrong. The Tobots are great inventions. And they've meant a lot to the city. But what if the boys wind up getting hurt? I designed the Tobots specifically to protect them, though I understand your concerns. Think on it. Limo, would you mind looking over the blueprints for me? Oh, sure. How did you get so dusty? Requesting a power wash. Rub a dub dub, two bots in a tub. Hmm, something stuck on you. Let me get that. Uh, I don't like trying new things. Do they have any pizza? I'm so sorry. I thought this would be a treat and a nice change for your father. Oh, oh, it's, it's okay. okay. <laughs> it's nice to try out a new restaurant. Oh, come in. <laughs> Give us all your fish right this very minute. <laughs> Duke! Duke. <sighs> it's those troublesome twins. <sighs> yeah, pass the fire extinguisher. <sighs> Dad, I'm really sick of you burning our food. We should have gone out with Ryan and Corey. What's the difference? You always order well done. <laughs> Would you hurry up? You two stay in there and watch We're the glass. Right now. <sighs> X, can't you do something? Assessing the situation. Hey, move! Get out of my way! So now you like ground level. Everybody quiet! Not the headlights! They can't fight in car mode, they'll lose. Where's Dylan? He's not picking up. Huh, we should call Nathan. Hmm. The new place? I'll be right there. Wait for me. Wow, <laughs> you know what? Uh, I've never been to a restaurant. Will they have engine oil soup or, or wiper fluid juice? Huh? I mean, will they? Huh? Sorry, I don't think so. Tobot W, transform! just watching them race out there. Don't worry too much. X and Y will take good care of them, okay? Are you sure? What if something goes wrong? To 
about the two of you. Let me look at you. Are huh? you sure you're both okay? Huh? What's that? It's, it's a slug bot. bot. Look, it's up already. Dolly does an amazing job with this site. How did she get this footage when she wasn't even there with us? I gave her access to W's video feed, and it's a good thing I did. She's already noticed some interesting stuff. Oh, by the way, I have something to tell you. The Tobots are meant to protect your kids. That's what they should do. But if Ryan, Corey, and Dylan are exposed to a lot of danger because of them, then it doesn't make much sense. Ah, this afternoon was a good example. We need to find a way for them to fight crime safely. Not exactly. I strongly believe the boys should stay out of it. Huh? It's not right. You've been asking the boys to do an adult's job here. Why don't you let the Tobots act as temporary bodyguards for the boys? In the meantime, the three of us will work on making a new and better robot that won't need their help. What's that? Are these blueprints? Of course. For a new super robot to protect the city. But where have you housed the mind core? Well, this robot doesn't actually have a mind core. Hmm? Why give a mind to a robot if you're only going to tell it what to do? Don't you find that idea cruel? Hmm. Sora does have a good point. But if this machine isn't capable of loyalty, it could become very, very dangerous. Anyone with enough robotic engineering knowledge could take it over. But it's specially encrypted. Nobody could break into this kind of AI. Only you, Franklin, and I will be able to control it. We'll finally be a real team. What do you say? Hold on! I am not okay with this. Why? It's just... I think... Ugh, it seems to me the Tobots should be the ones to protect the kids and our city. So then, you mean to say you never worry about your son? Franklin's done thousands of safety tests on the Tobots, and Dylan is an incredibly smart kid. He knows better than to get himself into a bad situation. Hmm. Limo, like you, I have total confidence in the kids, but Sora's plan sounds worthwhile. We have to be open to new ideas. I don't get it. Why don't you trust Sora, Dylan? I swear, she's a really nice person. You said she's been looking after X and Y ever since she got here. What if she's the one who secretly put the slug bots on them? Hey, don't say that. It's not fair. And don't forget, she's the one who found the spy flies that were in her yard. And why would she sabotage the Tobots? Wait, who was the last person to check on X and Y? I know. It must have been Limo. Hang on, about those slug bots. Weren't they just like the ones that limos used before? You're saying my dad's turned bad again? What? No, I didn't say anything like that. You're overreacting. Just stop picking on Sora, okay? Corey, I think you should wake up from your dream. Your genius dad is being manipulated. What? 
Hey, whoever asked your opinion, huh? Let's not forget all your dad's totally awesome choices. What? Take that back! Dylan, let's go. Okay. Huh. Wait, Limo! I'll give you a call later. Hmm. Maybe I shouldn't have said anything. Oh, no. What you said is right. He'll definitely come around. He just needs some time. Until he does, we can start without him. First of all, the new base. Right. You boys ready to help? Yeah. Sure. <laughs> so it'll be the four of us. Good night, Sora. We're going to bed. Night. Good night to both of you. Oh, thanks. You're the best. Of course. You had a long day, so you deserve some pampering. <sighs> You two deserve some attention. Franklin won't have time to care for you once he makes the new robot. I think he'll just be too busy. Really? Does not compute. Dr. Char never mentioned a new robot. Uh, what will the new one be called? Tobot! Tobot nerd! He's scrapping the Tobot system he used with you to go in a completely different direction. That is impossible. Ryan and Corey would never let him. Actually, it was their idea. You let that tiny slug bot control you. They think your systems are hopelessly outdated. What? <gasps> but no way! Don't you worry about it. I promise, I'll look after you both. You can trust me. Go, Tobas, go!